This is an eminent domain case uh, for a much needed water line. And the council's being asked today to vote to uh, settle this case with a man who has fought us for years and has cost Dallas taxpayers millions of dollars and intends to cost us millions more unless we settle with him by going around his property. Now other ordinary people, regular people like you and I, who can't afford to fight the city of Dallas over an eminent domain case for years and years, I mean, we wind up getting our property taken. Uh, and it's, it's, sometimes it's very necessary. We need water lines, we need roads, we need some of these public improvements. So I'm not blaming anyone that we're settling this case today. I mean, I totally understand that we're doing kind of what we have to do here. But it's just infuriating that if you are rich enough, you can hold the city hostage for years and then get what you want. There's something really wrong with that. Uh, and so I'm so conflicted on this vote. Didn't want to make the motion um, because while I so want to vote no on this, uh, neither do I want to continue to spend more money fighting with this guy because in the end, we're settling because he'll probably win. But it is just infuriating. We have people come down here saying, please don't take my property. And because they're just an ordinary person, we take their property. But this guy's rich enough to fight us for years, and so he is going to win. And it's just so maddening. Ms. Grayson, I appreciate your um, frustration because I am equally frustrated. <laughs> 